Okay, so I realise I haven't done a video in ages. And I realise I haven't reviewed this. Well, I haven't even opened it. And look, it's in a lovely little window box. I love these things. So, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I will be reviewing The Master with Cards. That's computer. Bah. So, here he is. And in the backdrop, um, of the packaging, you get a screen grab of the Doctors. And the Master's Cards, I think it is. Uh, I haven't watched the story enough. Why? So here's the mask. So if I just remove the various things he comes with. Um and start with articulation. The head can go side to side. I'm not sure if it can do a three six eight, I don't wanna force it in case I break it. The shoulders do a three hundred and sixty degrees. The arms do a 360 degrees turn at the bicep. Articulation at the elbow, 360 at the wrist, 360 at the thighs, and at the knees, and at the hips. And the waist, and that is its articulation. So let's look at the detail. Just wow! My goodness, it just looks like him with them um, all the hair sculpted into the back with the. Uh, it's black with it great wash and um watches sort of tan because obviously he was Spanish and that's right yeah. the beard with the bits of white in it as well the suit jacket sort of thing with all the black all around with the nice gloss texture on top with his little pockets and all the creases in the back in the gloves I, I can zoom in all the little textures and details and them have been done really nicely and the legs loads of creases because <laughs> uh, pretty much this is a brand new figure well it was because this is a re-release shoes um, just plain black uh, no laces that I can see but still really really nice and really good he comes with an accessory. Up to the light, which is his tissue compression eliminator or his TCSE short. It's a little hole in the front and that on the handle. It's got all the silver and the stuff at the bottom. And that just slides. It slides into his hand like that. So that's all well and good. It comes with um, the crystal of Kronos. I won't spoil the story for you, but oh boy, how much do I hate Kronos? The 
turn this computer back. This is interesting because um, it's been painted the wrong colours. Um, they painted this black, and really it should just be a darker green. Like so, don't know why. All these colors should be a lot darker. This is alright, I guess. It's playing everywhere else, and that it's got a little hole in the bottom. So photo cast. It would be nice if it did have a door, because you know I may be moaning, but the some towering spaceship that had a door, and that was roto cast. So I like, can this have a door. That will make a lot more sense. Um. Also, which is for the doctor is his um. Tiny whiny detector. Um, little gizmo. As in the first episode, uh, I can't remember if he had it in the second, but still. Well, it's uh, very nice. It's a nice little accessory. Which I keep dropping. Just slots into his hand. Into John's hand, so you, you could not put it in the master. Hat next to each other, ready to battle. Oh, until Roger Delgado's death. So, overall, I think, yeah, I like it. Because if you didn't want an axon, if you thought the axon looked stupid or something, or you couldn't afford it, or find it, uh, this one's quite a bit easier to get your hands on. I got mine off eBay for £20. I think for Vim Planet International School has it. I can't be certain, but you have to pay delivery. So I just got my £20 plus a couple of quid delivery. So thank you for watching this review if my voice sounds low. <coughs> That's just because I've got a sore throat and I've been skiing in the, out in the sun too long. <laughs>